It's normally a jam on the north side, but right now Lake Elizabeth is a mess full of goose droppings and algae. People who live nearby reached out to find out what's going on. John Shumway went looking for answers and has this report. With the city skyline in the distance and the amazing array of trees surrounding it, Lake Elizabeth in West Park should be a postcard waiting to happen. I mean, everything else is beautiful, but that's an eyesore. Those who live nearby say this is nothing new. This park has been neglected, no attention paid to it. It was a pretty pleasant place to sit up until about a week or so ago, and now it's a little sad looking. Sad because all the water has been drained out of the park, leaving it a real challenge for Mama Duck and her brood. You know, the algal blooms came up. We jumped, we dumped the water. We're going to have volunteers clean it up and help us clean it up. Pittsburgh Public Works Director Mike Gable says they do pay attention to the park and to the lake, which has had ongoing algae issues. Goose feces and sunshine <laughs> with no filtration. And they knew it. We generally do at least a couple cleanings a year. A plan to put aerators into the lake was derailed by a difference of design opinions, and the aerators wound up going to Highland Park. Doesn't mean the aerators can't go in. I mean, we're looking at that now. We have to find an electrical source, and if they're uh, not too expensive, we'll go and throw some aerators in there to help with the movement of the water. But that's further downstream. For now, the issue is cleaning up this mess. It's sad because this is such a wonderful asset for the city. This Saturday, the Pittsburgh Parks Conservancy will orchestrate a cleanup of the lake from 8 to noon. All volunteers welcome, just bring elbow grease, they'll provide the rest. Once we get it cleaned out, we'll fill it back up with water and it'll be a beautiful lake again. Which Gable hopes will be as soon as next week. In West Park, John Shumway, KDKA TV News.